Hi friends, it's Robin with Pale Bird Designs, and welcome back to Back to Basics Boot Camp Tumblr Edition, where me and two other amazing artists will share all the best tips, tricks, and Tumblr making secrets. This week, we're talking about peekaboos. So you're going to start with a prepped cup. I'm using the powder-coated 12-ounce cup from Craft Haven. There'll be a link in the description, and she actually has them on sale right now. They're one of my favorite cups to use. They come powder-coated in black or white, and I just find them super easy to use. So you're going to start with adding your layer of epoxy. As always, if I'm using a fine glitter, I like to tap it so I don't get any streaks. And we're going to start with this blue color for the bottom of our tumbler. Uh, I believe it's Dilly Dilly from the Glitter Guy. About a third of the way up the cup. And then Phenomenal Cosmic Power from the Glitter Guy. And I like to stay, I'm about six inches above the cup and lightly sprinkle for the heavier layers. And once I get to where I'm trying to ombre it a little bit more, I do go up higher and just lightly shake the bottle until I'm happy with the coverage. And spilled a little bit. Once our red and our blue's done, I'm going to go in with rainbow ice just to add a little bit extra sparkle to that center layer. And we'll let this spin until it's cured. Once that layer is cured, you're going to add a nice thick coat of epoxy so it's smooth for your peekaboo decals. And then once that layer is dry, we're going to add on our decals. I'm using a couple popsicle decals. <clears throat> Sorry. To finish this one and I thought I was gonna do four but the cups a little bit smaller than what I made my decals for so instead of keeping this one on I do take it off and make it three instead because four just wouldn't fit well on this cup so I space them out about every third of the cup just kind of eyeballing it I don't need them to be perfect this is just a fun little fourth of July Memorial Day type cup and then once your decals are on, you're going to go ahead and spray paint it. Add your next coat of epoxy. And I'm going to add some red, white, and blue glitter stars from the Glitter Guy as well. And I'm just going to sprinkle them all over the cup. however many I feel like. I just want this to be a fun little pop of color all over the place. Once that layer is dry, we're going to add on our outlines, which I'm using a matte holographic from Tick Wrap, and I'll link this below in the comments as well. Lightly press it on and then push out any bubbles if I have any. And repeat the process with the same other popsicles or the same other the other popsicles. That one I messed up. I always cut an extra outline because I usually mess one up. After we've gotten our last decal on, I'll go through and push them all down really well again and then add my last coat of epoxy. But I do trim off all these bottom pieces since I did have my popsicle sticks hanging off the edge when I put on my decals. Once that's done, you can add your final coat of epoxy and that's it. So this is a super fun, cute, easy peekaboo you can do it with any kinds of shapes. You can get do it with any kind of themes. 
So if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. If there is a type of tumbler you'd like to see us do for a boot camp week, let us know. And thanks for hanging out. See you next time. Bye, friends.